All right, so this, holy crap. Some new rods in the end of the day. So I've been talking about this for a long time. I've been throwing a few hints. If you've been paying attention on my community tab, you've seen I've been talking about this deal called Straight Up Fishing School. Well, I finally got it all put together and we're actually going to do that. February 29th, mark your calendars, come to Anderson, South Carolina. I'm going to leave the location address in the description box of this video. You got it? All the, all the information you need to know about this particular day, February 29th in Anderson, South Carolina, I'm going to do my very first straight up fishing school. Okay? Now, you probably wonder, what is a straight up fishing school? What are we talking about here, Brian? I, I don't want to go to school. I graduated in 1976. What are you talking about at school? Well, this is what we're going to do. We're going to cover a lot of topics that I talk about on the videos, but instead of you seeing a video and you kind of need to ask a question, a lot of times, you know, I, try, I do the best I can to answer everybody's questions in the comment section, but you know, it's just real life. Sometimes I can't get everybody's question. Well, in straight up fishing school, if I say crankbaits on rocks is what you need to do, and you got a question about what pound test line, what gear ratio reel, what kind of rod, what time of day, what sunlight, all the questions you actually have, I'll be there to address that question for you right there. That's what Straight Up Fishing School is gonna be about. I'm looking to do about three of these guys every year, okay? Now, like I said, make sure you go to the description box in this video. I'm gonna leave all the information that you can click to register for February 29th here in Anderson, South Carolina. Now, I know what you guys are gonna do in the comment section. Come to Texas, come to Arkansas, come to Wisconsin, come to Alaska, come to Europe. It's in Anderson, South Carolina. February 29th, you got about five weeks, six weeks. Book your plane tickets, figure out if you're gonna drive a train, whatever you gotta do, get here to Anderson, South Carolina. I promise you, I'm gonna make it worth it. I'm telling you, it's gonna be worth it. We're gonna talk about the topics. I'm gonna give you a few hints of what we're gonna talk about in this particular straight up fishing school, but it's gonna be worth it. If you fly down here to Anderson, South Carolina, I promise you, we're going to talk about a lot of different fishing topics. I'm going to make sure I cover a lot of stuff. We're going to spend all day with you. We're going to do a, a q and am going to feed you. You're going to have something to drink, and we can just sit down and chat and talk fishing. Now, probably, here's the kicker. This is what's definitely going to make it worth it. Well, there's a couple things that's going to make it worth it. One thing is, for sure, I'm 100% for a fact, no fake news, gonna give away a free trip the following Sunday. That Sunday, I'm gonna take two guests that register for this particular event. We're gonna go fishing. That's gonna make it worth it. I'm gonna take two guests that register for this event and we're gonna go fishing. So make sure you register. Come on down, fly, drive, get a train, ride your horse and buggy. Whatever you gotta do, get down here in Anderson, South Carolina, because it's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm gonna have music, I'm gonna have games, giraffe. I don't think we're gonna have any giraffes or animals. Maybe, maybe no games. We may have games. Actually, I do have a couple ideas for games. Um, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. And I'm not gonna put it on YouTube, because that's not fair to all the people that come to watch. They come to register for the event. Now, I mentioned we're going to do, oh, I didn't tell you guys, we're also going to do giveaways. So I'm going to have some of the guys that I work with, we're going to do a little baggie of giveaways. Dude, you're going to get, in giveaways, you're going to get a back about as much as it's going to cost you to register for this event. So basically, I'm letting you get an event for free. So make sure you come, bring your wife, bring your kids, especially for your kids. We're going to do an adjusted rate for kids versus the adults. So you guys that are in high school fishing, you guys are in college fishing. Maybe you're just new to fishing and you want to get better at it. I'm telling you, this is the event for you. This is designed just for you guys. It doesn't matter the skill level. I'm going to cover everything from the beginner fisherman all the way to the tournament fisherman. I'm going to give away some of the secrets that I don't ever talk about on YouTube because I don't want everybody to know them. I'm going to talk, give you some of my custom kits. A lot of the stuff that you see that I have on my website, shopblat.com, we're going to have all of that custom tackle. That tackle that you see that I have on shopblat.com, it's not like when you go in a store and you have all of this tackle to pick from. 
That stuff that I have on shopbelat.com, that is the same baits, hooks, line sinker that I keep out in my shop in the backyard. That's the stuff that I actually use. And I personally pick that out. So it's not just every color that Z-Man makes. It's not every color crankbait that's ever been made. It's not every piece of organizational tackle that you can buy. It's not every hook. It's only the hooks, only the baits, only the hard baits, only the top waters that I personally use in my tournaments and my outings out, out there on the water. So if you're interested in, the, in that tackle, you'll be able to get that at a discounted rate and you don't have to pay shipping, of course, if you come to the event. So it's going to be fun. It's going to be worth it. So I want to make sure that you guys come. Don't wait for me to come to your hometown. Maybe I might not come to your hometown. Who knows? I'm, I mean, I'm going to go a lot of places with this, but I may not come to your specific hometown. So if you're in the surrounding area, South Carolina, North Carolina, Georgia, Tennessee, I want to see you there. I definitely want to see you there. Description box. Okay. Description box. Everything is in there. The location, the address, the link to register for the event um, it's all going to be in the description box of this video so i really hope you guys register let's talk a little bit about what i'm actually going to be talking about at the event i'm uh, probably going to have to look on my computer i think i got it i think i've got it written down here because there's there's a there's a lot in this there's a lot that, I, that i've got planned and i needed to uh i couldn't i couldn't remember it all so we're going to do pre-spawn. We're going to tell, so obviously this is late February. This is when we're starting to get into the pre-spawn, right? Fisher, or not quite in this area. If you live in that Tennessee, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia area, fish are not on the bed typically in February, but when we start to get to March, March, it's real touch and go. They can go, or it could be a month away. It's almost always a pre-spawn event when you're talking about March. So I know leading up to that, some of the questions you guys are going to have is how do I catch fish due to pre-spawn? So that's what we're gonna talk about. But more specifically, what we're gonna talk about when it comes to pre-spawn is how to catch largemouth during the pre-spawn. I know if you live in these lakes around here, we have two species predominantly in all of our lakes. We've got largemouth and we've got some species of spotted bass, okay? And it can be a little, lines can be a little blurry on how to actually target spotted bass versus targeting largemouth. And I'm gonna try my best to teach you guys what you need to do if you specifically wanna catch largemouth in your tournaments. Or perhaps you wanna specifically catch spotted bass in your tournaments. What I'm gonna do is break down how I would approach each species of fish. If I wanna catch largemouth, maybe I'm going back in the creeks, I'm gonna talk about the, the baits that I use, I'm gonna talk about the setups that I use, and not only that, I'm gonna take a lot of my tournament fishing from the tournaments that I had. Some of those YouTube videos, I know in my YouTube videos, you get to see the footage. Sometimes I don't have time to go into a lot of detail of my thought process when I'm switching baits, when I'm switching locations. There's a lot that you, get to, you don't get to see. Keep in mind, that's two, three, or four days, eight hour days that I've condensed into 25 minutes. So there's a lot that I don't get to talk about in those videos. So we're gonna take pieces of those videos from when I won at Seminole. We're gonna take pieces from Grand Lake when I caught one limit in four days and ended up turning that into a top 10. We're gonna take those little pieces out and some of those key parts that made those events successful for me, I'm gonna talk about them and tell you what I was thinking about them, why I made those decisions, and possibly I really think that information is gonna help you in your tournaments. It's gonna to help you in your outings. It's gonna help you when you're fishing with your kids. It's just gonna make you a better fisherman in general. Because it was, some of these things are things that I wish people would have told me when I was coming along, but I didn't, I didn't have those relationships. But this is gonna be that resource that you can have to show you how to use different baits and how to target fish during this particular time of the year. So pre-spawn, we're gonna talk about the pre-spawn largemouth, pre-spawn spotted bass, what you need to do, what you need to throw, what kind of tackle you need to be looking for. That's what we're gonna cover in this first one. Now, later on this, this year, we're gonna schedule some others. We're gonna to try to do like three for each season, whether you're pre-spawn, maybe a spawn, a post-spawn, and also a, a, winter, a fall winter session too. So we're gonna be looking for locations, to, to host this next couple of uh, straight up fishing schools, but this is the kickoff 
Guys, show me that you're interested in this. Register for it. If you don't register for it, I'm just gonna keep doing what I'm doing. But I'm, I'm telling you, I really think this is gonna be something that's valuable for you. I think you're gonna learn. I think you're gonna love it. So make sure you do, it. check out the description box, all the information. I'm gonna say it one more time for the people in the back that didn't hear me. If you're in the back and you didn't hear me, check out the description. All the links to register for the event will be available February 29th, Saturday, 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Make sure you're there. Two people at this event will win a fishing trip with me on Lake Hartwell, and we're gonna catch them. I promise you we're gonna have a good time. You won't regret it. It's gonna be a trip that I promise you will be valuable. I wanna see you there. Are you coming? I wanna see you there!